this is Stampy, and welcome back to my Let's Play on a Yo-Kai Watch. And in the last episode, it was a pretty exciting times because I got myself a, uh, a bicycle. Uh, so yeah, now I can go and uh, ride around the town uh, a lot quicker uh, than I was able to before. And I was told uh, to go down to um, to Flower Road, I think it's called. So uh, yeah, that's uh, that's where we're gonna be uh, gonna be heading to. So I don't know what's gonna be there. But just the fact that the game is telling me to, to go there, I reckon there's there's got to be something going on down there. So yeah, it says ride your bike to Flower Road. Apparently it's just a, a good place to, to ride around. And oh, I think we might be going back downtown again. And hello, look at this guy. <laughs> this way, this way. Oh, should I follow him? Am I supposed to follow him? Um, okay, let's go and uh, <laughs> follow this guy, yokai. I seem to have, uh, I've got a little bit distracted, but yeah, let's, uh, let's find out what this guy wants and why I'm following him. Oh, look, he's led me down, down to here. Remember to shout, shut off your faucets. Um, okay. <laughs> Is that it? Is that why we've come all the way down here? Um, Right, let's let's get back onto our, our mission of going to, to ride to, to Flower Road. There is like a million things that I could be doing right now. There's uh, all of these different side missions uh, that are available uh, right now as well. And I will go and uh, do more of them. I think kind of just like I did then, like when I just kind of run into to things... Um, like on the way and oh be careful here's the the police car hopefully you're allowed to to ride your um your bike on the sidewalk here and aren't going to get told off all right then is this is this flower road ah i think it is doesn't look like a particularly good place to to ride a bike down though if you ask me so this is flower road eh quite a few shops around here should we pick up some provisions while it's convenient um thanks for reminding me i want to see if the comic book's out yet let's go to the bookstore they might have something on yokai too uh, settle in Bookstar is down in the uh, the south end of the road. Right, go to Settle in Bookstore. This is a pretty cool looking road. Look at all of these shops. Can I like go in these? I think I can. I think I can actually go in all of these uh these different shops. Not too uh, not too bad. It looks like this is probably the uh the best place for for shopping. Then uh, what's this place here? Like there's like a weird like action man type guy on the the outside there uh, seems like a bunch of restaurants uh, i can get a bunch of different meats and uh, let's go down to the uh the the bookstore then oh, i think i went too far i think i went out the uh, uh the other end of um uh, of flower road is this the uh the settle in bookstore uh, it looks like it is oh uh, yeah let's uh, uh settle in <laughs> go inside and uh see what's going on there's got to be something going on uh inside of here i told you before sir we have absolutely no intention of doing that Look, I've got a lot to do, so I'm afraid I must ask you to leave. Fine then. I'll be back. What's going on here? I knew we were going to stumble into something. And the chances are, knowing this game, a yokai is involved in, a, in some way. I wonder what was going on there. Look like some sort of trouble may be brewing. Let's ask the shopkeeper. I wonder what the uh, the businessman was asking for the bookstore to do then. <laughs> You'd think uh, whatever's going on at a bookstore would be pretty harmless, but yeah, who knows? Hey there, Stampy. Sorry you had to see that. Everything okay? Yeah, it's just my daily visit from those builders who want this property. They want to turn this place into some generic mall. You believe that? What, really? A tear down Flower Road? Well, I'm not going anywhere, but still, something has been bothering me. Strange things have been happening ever since the mall talk started. Everyone's saying that the guardian angel is angry. Oh, sure, the um guardian angel. Yeah, sure, right. That's the guardian deity of Flower Road. He'll be homeless if it gets bulldozed for a row of jumbo pretzel kiosks. Now, I'm not superstitious, but I saw something odd the other day. Oh, whoops, well, sorry, I actually got a lot of work to do. But if you're interested in finding out on, uh, more about what's going on, you might ask the science teacher of yours for more details. He seems to know a lot about it. He was just here, actually. He might still be around. Find your science teacher. Okay, can I just go, like, shopping now as well, then? Uh, let's, uh, let's buy some books, then. What, 
What do the books do? Whoa! 250 pounds? A Serious Life. A book about giving life, um, all, uh, la, la. a book about giving life your all. Uh, good for lazy yokai. <laughs> Makes yokai loafless. Oh, that's actually really handy. So what do these do? A book on karate? Oh, so these are like ways you can like upgrade your yokai by giving things to them. Makes them less grouchy, makes them more logical, makes them more twisted, makes them more healthy. It seems like the, the loafless seems to be the uh, uh, the best one. So if I get a, um, let's get like a caring one. Was there a caring one? Grouchy, uh, careful, uh, important on defense. Let's uh, let's buy one. Let's do get guarding. Let's uh, buy one of, uh, of these. And uh, do I just go and give this to, to one of my yokai then? Uh, let's go to my inventory and let's uh, kind of work this out. Where are where are books? Uh, so let's go and give this to... Um, oh, so it makes yokai careful. Oh, so I can change them from what they are. So let's change that. There we go, I've changed it so he's now um, caring instead of, uh, instead of grouchy. I don't think Jabanyan was grouchy anyway, do you? I wouldn't call Jabanyan grouchy. Anyway, let's see if we can find my science teacher. I think this is the, the businessman. The pest's quest. Well, this is the bestseller, huh? Sounds interesting. I don't know if that was the guy trying to buy. I know it's this. I think this is my science teacher, isn't it? Uh, nope. Uh, look at this side road. It's so dark and scary. Well, I would have a look if you weren't in the way. Oh, is he talking about down here? <laughs> I thought he was talking about right where he was. Uh, he was standing. Right. What is in this side road? Nothing down here, uh, I don't think. And let's go and have a little bit of a wander around. I doubt my uh, science teacher's down here, but whoa! There's Yokai! Run away! <laughs> it looks like there might be like um. Kind of like a dungeon area around here then. Where's my... Oh, is this my science teacher? I think this might be Mr. Barton. Hey there, Stumpy. Oh, hi, Mr. Barton. What a surprise to see you here. <laughs> so, how's it going? School is great. I love school and uh, you're a great teacher. Um, can you tell me what you know about the, fl uh, the flower road deities? Ha ha ha. Well, it's good to see you too, Stumpy. You want to know about the guardian angel's curse, do you? Um, I, I think so. Is that what people are calling it? I'm not sure if it's a curse per se, but strange things are definitely afoot. We have seen a lot of accidents. There was a fire after the mall talks began. Nothing has really escalated into a big problem. Not yet, anyway. I can't help but wonder what will happen if this continues, though. Oh, wow, I hadn't heard about any of this before. This kind of thing can start a mischief, but it really can't escalate that quickly. I believe your classmate Lucas was there when the fire started. Lucas? If you're interested, you might want to ask him what he knows. I saw him over near the Every Mart on my way here. He might still be there. I like the way this guy thinks. Let's go and see what Lucas knows. Thanks, Mr. Barton. No problem. Always happy to talk about ghosts and curses. Be careful, Stampy. And if you find anything, you didn't hear a bit from me, okay? Okay, well, let's go speak to Lucas then. But first, let's have a look down some of these side roads then. Because it looks like there might be like little dungeons. Okay, this just kind of leads me back out to the, the town. There's just so much going on around here. There's just so many places I can go into. Let's go and try and find that, um... That side street then. I feel like battling. I feel like battling some yokai. Uh, especially since I got that was that in the, the last episode. And I haven't had a, a chance to, to test it out. Uh, so yeah, let's have a little bit of a, a wander around here. Battle a few of the uh, the cheek squeaks. <laughs> the um the farty Pokemon. And uh, yeah, let's go and get into some uh, some combats. I do want to uh, to start trying to, to capture some more yokai as well. Uh, some more uh, uh, more ones that are better at, at, uh, at attacking. That is kind of the, the goal. So yeah, uh, let's kind of just keep battling these yokai and to see if I'm eventually uh, going to end up being able to, to capture any of them. And whoa, Jabanyan is getting destroyed. Did you see that? Jabanyan's almost taken out. All right, let's, uh, let's switch around it a little bit and uh, let's go and give this uh, this Wazat a little bit of a, of a go then, shall we? I've got a, a mysterious bonus because uh, both Tattletail and uh, Wazat uh, are both um, yeah in the uh, the mysterious tribe. So that's good. Uh, this is probably a, a pretty nice combo to, to have. I can't believe how quickly Jabanyan got taken down, though. It looks like everyone on the... Um the other team is pretty uh, sad. Uh, so let's go and do uh, a little bit of a, of a loving slap uh, from uh, from Tattletail. And uh, hopefully uh, that's going to be uh, uh, enough uh, to be able to, to finish them off. It's weird, like I had to really start getting used to uh, not being able to, to see their health. 
Because normally in games like this, you know, you kind of at least know uh, how much um, health the, uh, the enemies have. Uh, but in this game, you really like, uh, you really have no idea. Oh, there we go. So now I can see the health. Oh, can you only see it when you go to target them? Look at that. When I go to target them, you can then see how much health they have, but it's not up the, uh, the entire time. That's a little bit weird, isn't it? Anyway, let's go and, uh, and purify uh, Jibanyan, uh, just uh, to try and get his health back up. And I think uh, this final cheek squeak uh, should probably uh, just about be ready to, to go down. And uh, let's go and uh, let's go and heal up Jibanyan uh, in between this battle and the, the next battle. I still feel a little bit underpowered at the moment. I think that because I've been avoiding battling so much, like I haven't been getting uh, as much uh, experience uh, as, uh, as I should be. Uh, so yeah, kind of coming down here is probably a, a good idea. But look at that. Jibanyan only has five uh, health points left. So let's... Um, uh, go and uh, give him a, a nice uh, plum rice ball, uh, which uh, should get his health up a little bit. Let's go and do another one as well. So there we go. His health's uh, pretty much uh, fully back up, so I should be ready for the uh, the next go. So it looks like I can go down here, but then there's also another bunch of streets at the, the top. Uh, so it looks like I'm down in the, the sewer. I think there's a, um, a doorway here, but let's see if I can get through. I think I need the, the key. Oh no, I unlocked it. I guess, I guess I did have the uh, the key then. Let's go. Uh, let's go and jump over these. And it looks like there's a um uh, another doorway over here. Am I going to be able to to unlock this one? Okay, this one seems to be. Oh, I need to open that one from the other side. Okay, looks like I need to to probably find uh, another way to to enter it. And uh, what's going on down here? Oh, am I searching? Oh, do I get the can? What am What am I looking? Am I looking for fish? I don't even know what it is I'm searching for down here. Do you reckon there's um any yokai down here? I don't know if I'm even searching for for yokai at the moment. Uh, let's uh, let's not worry about that then. Uh, let's go and uh, and back off and uh, let's go um let's go around the other side because I think I did see uh, a box on the the other end over here. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, try and battle this yokai uh, and then hopefully uh, we can go and uh, yeah get whatever's in the the box. We've got some lead balloons. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, let's go and, uh, and battle. Uh, luckily, uh, Jibanyan's back up and fighting, so we can start straight off with my favorite move, the Paws of Fury. And uh, yeah, do a bunch of damage against uh, all of them. And then yeah, then we're going to go and target uh, a specific one and uh, try and take them out one at a time, because uh, that definitely seems to be the uh, the best way to, to do things. So let's uh, target uh, this guy in the uh, the middle, uh, see if we can take them out first. And oh no, Tattletail's been taken down. Did you see that? Tattletail is down already. That is uh, uh, is not very good. Let's go and uh, try and use uh, Kappa's uh, Sultimate. If I go and uh, try and pop all of these. Oh no, but look at that. Kappa's getting really hurt as well. I think I'm not strong enough. I don't know, do you think that I'm supposed to be stronger before I come down here? Like, I'm just about handling uh, handling myself, but I am taking uh, a lot more damage uh, than I uh, would have uh, would have hoped to. And it looks like uh, Jibanyan's uh, inspirited, so let's go for like a, a complete switch around, and uh, let's try and start healing some people up. So let's uh, uh, heal Kappa first, uh, seeing as he's still out uh, battling, and then I can get Dismerelda. Uh, to go and use her soul to move. And oh look, there's an orb. There's one of those things floating around. Let's go and grab that. Because uh, that's uh, a good way to, to try and get some uh, some more items. So uh, once I've used the Dismartillery <laughs> to, to hopefully deal some damage. Not a huge amount of damage uh, against them though. No, no, I think I lost it. Oh, I, th I think I lost the, the orb. I was too slow uh, using the uh, the ultimate move. Uh, luckily, though, they are all pretty weak at the, the moment. Uh, so let's go and use a uh, was that special move. I can't really remember what it is. Uh, but yeah, whatever it is, let's go and try and, uh, and use it. And uh, hopefully uh, it's going to be something to, to deal some damage uh, against them. It's called the world was that or something like that. Uh, or oh, just uh, increased uh, some of the uh, the the stats, so uh, yeah, not particularly convenient, but hopefully I should be uh, strong enough just to to take out these last few people. And oh, I haven't been um I haven't been purifying them. I need to go and get them uh, them purified, uh, so I can go and uh, bring them back out uh, in case was that or or Kappa uh, gets uh, inspirited. So uh, I'm really not doing uh not doing very much uh, damage here at all. Let's go and try and get uh, Jibanyan's uh, help up, and then hopefully if I bring Jibanyan uh, out, uh, that's going to be enough to to finish them off. But look at this! I'm getting totally destroyed. Right, let's switch around. I've hardly got anyone left at the moment. This is going really, really badly. Luckily for me, I do have a, a pause of fury. So hopefully this is going to be just about enough uh, to, to finish them off. So this is kind of, this has definitely confirmed to me one of two things. Either I am just absolutely rubbish at combat, which, which might be uh, the truth. That might be uh, what's going on here. Or I just really need to go and uh, try and start leveling up uh, a lot more of... Um, of my yokai, uh, because I think they just simply might not be uh, uh, strong enough. So let's go and uh, try and purify Jibanyan, and then we can go and bring him out. 
And then let's just basically switch it around so I can then go and uh, purify uh, Baku. So let's go and pop all of these. And then, yeah, I'll be able to, to bring them uh, them both out. And, uh, yeah, we can just go and target this last person. I mean, there's only one person left, so <laughs> it probably doesn't really matter about targeting them. And then, yeah, we should be able to, to take them out. But look at that. I've only got two yokai left after, like, this whole time. They're the only two yokai I have left. That was a little bit worrying. Like, they weren't even a boss or any special yokai. They were just random yokai I stumbled across in the, uh, the sewer. Luckily, I am kind of leveling up now, you know, which is getting everyone's strength up and we are learning more techniques and stuff. But yeah, that's still um, pretty wonder uh, pretty worrying. So there we go. They've all now got like one HP again. So let's be really careful uh, to try and not run into to any more yokai uh, while we're uh, down here. And uh, let's go and uh, instead uh, try and track down Lucas. I did get a green coin after all of that. I'm not entirely sure what a green coin does, but <laughs> I was able to, to get a green coin. So let's try and be super careful uh, not to run into any yokai, because if I do, I really think it might be my downfall. Hopefully there's not one waiting at the top of this pipe anymore. Is there any here? Are we okay? I think we're okay. Let's make a mad dash <laughs> back into to Flower Road. And I think I was able to, to survive su uh, successfully. <laughs> right, are there any um are there any iPos around here? I'd love to uh, to try and get my uh, my health back up uh, just in case I do run into any more yokai. Like you find them in um in shops quite a lot, don't you? The uh, the iPo. I don't think there's one in here. Look at this laundrette. This is a this isn't a place I'd really like to go to clean my clothes, seeing has how dirty it is. Let's speak to this person. Oh, this place is beyond dirty. It smells like mold in here. I can't stand it. Disgusting. Do you work here? Or are you just a random lady complaining? If you work here, then get a broom out. You know, clean the place up a little bit. <laughs> There's a box here as well that I keep running past. I got some uh, pot stickers, whatever they are. Looks like some type of food. Uh, where's a um? Where's an iPo? Aha! It looks like there's one kind of right where uh, we're heading to anyway. I believe uh, that this is a uh, Lucas here. You can kind of see him on the uh, the the map. Uh, but it looks like there's uh, an iPo uh, right inside of this mart. So yeah, before we go and speak to him, uh, just in case uh, a random yokai jumps out of me from somewhere, which uh, does. Have happen in this game it does happen quite a lot <laughs> uh, yeah let's go and uh, speak to, to Lucas and see if we can get down to the uh, the mystery of uh, of flower road oh hi stampy you picking up some gum too um uh, I'm not actually I'm glad I ran into you though I wanted to ask you something oh yeah what what's up I heard you were around when that fire started is that true um yeah it, it, it's true I must have been seeing things because I swear the fire just started on its own. I knew it would get bad if it spread, so I took off to find a grown-up. They put the fire out really fast, so that was good. But they still don't know how it started. There's no doubt in my mind that there's a yokai behind this. Lucas didn't see anything said the fire because he can't see yokai. Where did the fire start, Lucas? It was over near the Nocturne Hospital. Nocturne Hospital? Didn't that place shut down a while ago? We've got to go there and investigate. Thanks for the info, Lucas. Okay, looks like we need to, to head to the uh, the hospital. The plot seems to be thickening and thickening. And oh, I shouldn't have done that. I crossed the road without looking. <laughs> I don't know what the rules are when I have a with a bike. The thing is, I can't see very far uh, ahead of me. So it's kind of hard to uh, to know. And it looks like that's the hospital. I did see hidden in the... um. Uh, the 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 grass that there was a box and aha we can break our way in there's a hole in the the wall hmm, this place looks abandoned this certainly is the spookiest abandoned hospital i've ever seen oh stampy point your watch over in that direction quickly what is it looks ah i knew it there's a yokai involved Oh, I know this one. I think this is the one that goes around and tries to make girls fall in love with it and tries to make itself look really pretty. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, no, no, no. I don't like this one bit. They will pay dearly for messing around in my territory. I could punish them myself, but where's the fun in that? Is that the guardian angel everyone was talking about? I'm not sure. This could be a different guardian angel. Oh, yes, of course. It's probably that one. His aura is quite powerful. This one is a true guardian spirit. 
You boys don't seem to have any respect for personal space either. You caught me in a dreadful mood. That's bad news for you. I'll take care of you soon, but not here and not now. When night falls, meet me over at the construction site downtown. We'll play there, be there, or live with the regret. Well, that sounds uh, a little bit ominous, doesn't it? <laughs> well, that was weird. <gasps> There's something about his attitude that makes me curious. Let's head to the construction site at nightfall. If he's behind the accidents at Flower Road, we need to put a stop to him. Agreed. Okay, looks like that's the uh, the, the plan. Go to the building site at night time. But before we do that, uh, let's go and uh, uh, have a look inside of this box, see if we can get any goodies. Looks like I got a plain ring. Fantastic. Just what I've always wanted. A plain ring. <laughs> and it looks like I can't get into the, the hospital uh, until my yokai watch uh, is level 5. And at the moment, I think it's only like level D or something. So it looks like uh, we have quite a, little of a, uh, quite a lot of work to do uh, before I'm uh, going to be able to, to get to the uh, the hospital. Uh, but yeah, and that's about the end of this episode here. In the, the next episode, I'm going to go to the uh, the construction site and uh, yeah, see if we can put a, a stop to that yokai and all of the uh, the bad things uh, they're making uh, happen at, uh, at Flower Road. I'm excited about the possibilities. It looks like we've found uh, quite a big new area and there's lots of shops and kind of lots of uh, things for us to, to find and uh, do in this town. It is a little bit overwhelming if I'm honest, but that's good. You know, it means that uh, we're certainly not going to, to get bored uh, anytime soon. So uh, yeah, in between uh, this episode and the, uh, the the next episode, I'm probably going to go and try and level up my yokai a bit because I think I'm probably not strong enough to battle that yokai yet. So yeah, I'm going to try and tough, uh, toughen up all of my yokai, maybe catch a few more even because I kind of don't control when I capture them. I kind of just do it anyway when battling. So uh, yeah, I'm going to do that between this episode and the, the next episode. And uh, yeah, then uh, we'll be able to, to carry on. So uh, that's the end of uh, this video here. There'll be a link in the uh, description to the next one once it's uh, online. But for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!